Good afternoon, how are you guys doing today? Good? So, I don't know about you guys, but I like clam. All kinds of clam, especially razor clam, because it's like eating a whole string of clam. And the thing about them is that they are seasonal, so it's not like you can have them all year long. So whenever they have it at the restaurant, you know, I will order it. Uh, at first it was like $15, you get like 10 or 12. But now it's like $20, but you only get like seven or eight. And then, you know, with me, I have to share with my wife. So it's like, I'm getting like four. That's not satisfying. So anyways, uh, earlier today when I was at H-Mart, you know, I was just browsing through the seafood section as usual. And guess what I saw? Razor clam. And at $14.99 per pound, I grabbed two of them. And I counted them and they're like 26 clam. So 26 clam for $31 versus eight clam for $20. Ah. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like we're getting a better deal if we cook it ourselves. For the razor clam, we can just put it on the grill and then put some scallion and oil on top. But you guys know what would be even better? Stir fry them with basil. That's like the most popular way that they cook it at the restaurant. So today, I'm gonna show you guys how to stir fry razor clam with basil. If you're ready, let's start cooking. So these are all the ingredients that you would need. You need some razor clam. You're gonna need the sauce mixture. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that in a little bit. You're gonna need some chicken broth. You're gonna need some potato starch. You need some onions, some uh, serrano pepper or jalapenos, basil, and scallion. And also, you're gonna need one of these. All right, so now I'm gonna show you guys how to make the uh, sauce that go on top of the razor clam. So what you're gonna need is, you're gonna need two tablespoons full of uh, soy sauce, preferably this brand, and then one tablespoon of oyster sauce, and then one tablespoon full of uh, sugar, and then half a teaspoon of um, black pepper. And then we're just gonna mix it all up together. All right, soy sauce going first, then oyster sauce, and sugar. And just mix it up. And then I'm gonna add in the um, black pepper. Mix that up. And it should look something like this. I'll taste it real quick, Let's see. A little salty, a little sweet, a little peppery. And we're gonna set this aside. Then you're gonna need either two tablespoons full of potato starch or cornstarch, whichever you prefer. I'm gonna use potato starch instead. Just one tablespoon, two. And then so if it's two, you're gonna double it with the water, so it's gonna be four tablespoons full of water. So one, two, three, four. And we're gonna mix it up. And we're gonna leave it on the side. And then we're gonna need one cup full of chicken broth. See, it's about this much. And then we're gonna put it on the side. And then you're gonna need one jalapenos, but I like to use this serrano pepper because they are spicy. Smell delicious. And then we're gonna put it on the side. And then we're gonna need some uh, scallion, just the green part only. And then we're gonna put it on the side. And then we're gonna need some onions. All right, and put it on the side. And last but not least, you're gonna need some Thai basil. Um, people cut these up, but you know, I like to leave the whole leaf. So I'm just gonna pluck them. I don't know about you guys, but I love basil. Okay, I'll save these and then we're gonna grow them later on. So this is all the ingredient that you would need to make this dish. I already soaked them in the water for like 20 minutes, but you know, 
But make sure before you guys uh, cook them, make sure you guys wash them out because they're very sandy. Oh. See, this is how much you get at the restaurant for $20. This is how much you get if you buy yourself $31. $20, $31. Come on, which one's the better deal? And look, look at this, look how big it is. Woo! Look at that. You're gonna be eating good. So here we go. First, I'm gonna turn to about seven or six. Add some oil. Let it heat up. All right, let's start heat up. And add an onion. And then we're gonna fry it until it get kind of golden. So now we're gonna add in our clam. Turn on the heat to uh, maybe seven or eight. And then we're gonna add in our soft mixture. Get every single bit of it. Mix it up. And then we're gonna throw in the uh, serrano pepper. And then we're gonna cover it for like about a minute or two. And let it cook. Mmm. Wow. It smells delicious. Yeah, with the clam, you don't wanna cook it for too long because if you cook it for too long, it's gonna be chewy. It won't be good anymore. See, it shrinks up. You guys see that? All right, now you're gonna pour in the uh, chicken broth. And we're gonna cover it up. So we let it cook for a little bit more. All right, this is when you guys should taste the uh, sauce and see if you guys like it. Oh, wow. It's sweet. And it's spicy. Thanks to the uh, serrano pepper. I would just add a little bit of um, pepper sauce, just a little bit. Yeah, this is good. This is real good. Since it's boiling like this, this is when we add in our potato starch. Just add in a little bit at a time. So you guys see it? It's uh, thickening up. And that means we are about to be done. And all we gotta do now is add in the uh, green onions and the basil. We don't need that much time with this. Man, I wish you guys could smell this. Smell delicious. And that is it. We are done. You guys see that? Get all that smoke. Oh. All right, so all we have to do now is put it on the plate and enjoy. Oh man, look at this, guys. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. They're off the shelf, so they mean they're done. Look at that, baby. Oh man. Oh, my wife is gonna love this. Don't forget the sauce, they go on top. Oh, you don't wanna waste this good sauce. All right, let's go enjoy. <laughs> you guys ready? Oh man. Can't wait. Yeah, usually, um, you know, I'll eat this too with a uh, sriracha, but I think with the uh, serrano pepper, I don't think we need it. And I'm just gonna use my hand. Ready? Dip in the sauce. Dip with some sriracha. Oh. It's 
tastes like, like the restaurant. I'm gonna chase it down with some rice. Get some scallion. Get some basil. Hmm. Wow. Finger looking good for real. So delicious. I don't think I'm gonna go back to the restaurant anymore again after this. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at this. Mm. Mm, the sauce. Mm. Wow. Okay, I'm sorry about guys, but I think I'm gonna do one more so you guys can see it. You guys see that? Huh? Dip with some sriracha. Wow, it tastes just like a regular clam, but longer and better. Mm. The serrano pepper, oh, it has a lot of heat. Way better than the jalapeno. You guys should make this and let me know what you think of it. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much if you're seeing to the end. Be sure to hit the subscribe button on your way out and I'll see you soon. I am sweating, but it is so delicious.